if you can go back in time, what would you do? I mean, really think about it. I know most people would probably predict lotto numbers and become millionaires. Some people might just go to um, like an old school civilization and just hang out. I don't know. What I would do is I would do a card trick. I know that sounds very ridiculous, but it's true. Let me put this in frame. I would do a card trick, and this is the one I would do. Now, at present time, right here, right now, this is the condition of the deck. As you can see, it's mixed up pretty randomly, red cards and black cards mixed throughout. Now, this is present time, and to make it easier to remember, let's call present time stage one. Okay, so that was stage one. Now, if I alter the condition of the deck by separating the colors, so if I take all of the red cards and separate them from all of the black cards, well, then we're no longer going to be at stage one. Because as you can see, all of the red cards, every single one, is separated from all of the black cards. Again, every single one. So we're no longer, obviously, in stage two. Now, this brings us to our second stage. Let me separate the colors. Here we go. Stage two is simple. In stage two, all the cards face the same way. And in this case, the red cards are all facing up. But if I change the condition by taking about half of the red cards and shuffling these cards face up into face down, like so. Well then the red cards are no longer in stage two. But the black cards are. So let me alter the condition of the black cards by taking about half of them and shuffling half the cards face up into face down. So now the black cards, because they're mixed face up into face down, are no longer in stage two either. Okay. This brings us to stage three. In stage three, the eight of hearts is on top of the red packet. Sir, please remember the eight of hearts. And the four of spades is on top of the black packet. Ma'am, remember the four of spades. But let's alter the condition of these cards. So if I take the uh, eight of hearts, place it in the center, no longer in stage three. If I take the four of spades, Place it in center. Again, no longer in stage three. Okay, so that was a big buildup. Let's recap what we did. Remember at stage one, the cards were spread out, mixed, red cards, black cards, randomly throughout the deck. In stage two, all of the cards faced the same direction. At stage three, we had the eight of hearts on top of the red pile, and the four of spades on top of the black pile. So let's go back in time. If we go back in time, back to stage three, then of course we should have the eight of hearts on top of the red pile and the four of spades on top of the black. Very interesting. If we go further back in time, all the way back to stage two, then all, the, all of the cards should be facing the same way. If we go still further back in time, all the way back to stage one, then every single card in this deck should be mixed randomly, red cards and black cards throughout the entire pack. And here we are, back at present time. Thank you.